Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Windows 10 Start Menu Search is not actually displaying any search results, or it might be showing a white or just black screen, or just start typing the search for apps, and it's not actually coming back with any results. So I'm going to show you guys how to resolve that without too much of a hassle, and we're going to jump right into it. So we're going to start by right-clicking on the Start button, so if you have an option for command prompt, you're more than welcome to select it. Otherwise, select Windows PowerShell Admin. You can use either or in this tutorial. So I'm going to select Windows PowerShell because that was one of the options. And I'm going to have a command in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy it. So just go ahead and copy from my description. It should start with start, ms, and then slash settings. And there should be a little colon after that. So you want to make sure you copy that whole command. Go to the top bar of the Windows PowerShell window, right click on it, left click on edit, and then left click on paste, paste it in. Hit enter on the keyboard once it's in there. Now that you're here, you want to go click inside the box that says find the setting or the search menu within the Windows settings UI. Type in troubleshoot, and one of the best managers should come back will troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and left click on that, and that'll take us directly to the troubleshooting menu. You want to go ahead here and scroll down to search and indexing, find and fix problems with Windows Search, and then select run the troubleshooter. So you can select search or indexing is slowing down the computer, or perhaps files don't appear in search results. Or you can also select my problem is listed above, so just continue on here with whatever's most applicable. You're welcome to try different paths, so the first one doesn't lead you to a positive result. You can try a different option, so go ahead and select Try Troubleshooting as Administrator, as it's recommending in my case, so it'll give you suggestions as you go along here. So I'm going to go ahead and select the same option I did the first time, just wanted to check as an admin. I couldn't identify the problem, so if I went and closed out of here, and let's say I ran the troubleshooter again, looks like it's opening up down in the taskbar. Let's say my problem isn't listed above, and we select next. Could enter any brief description, so no search results showing. And then select next. So I try troubleshooting as an administrator. Again, it looks like it's going to make us go back in here, so no search results showing. I mean, you can type in whatever you want. I think it's just trying to look for something that might be more applicable for you guys. So couldn't identify the problem in our case because everything looks like it's all good. But I'm just putting it out there. So hopefully in your case, if you went through these steps, it would be able to resolve the problem. So another thing you can try if you close out of here, and we are back in Windows PowerShell, you can always right click on the Start button again to reopen it. I'm going to have another command in the description. We're going to be reinstalling their Cortana functionality. So go up to the top bar of the Windows PowerShell once you've copied it from my description. Right click on it, left click on edit, and then left click on paste to paste it in here. Once it's pasted in, it should have a blinking cursor, so just give it a moment. So once that's done, close out of here, restart your computer, and hopefully that would have been able to resolve your problem. You can also try booting in the safe mode as well, or use the recovery menu option. So if you have the Windows 10 Media Creation Utility, burn it to a DVD, USB, boot your computer from it, and then run System Restore or some kind of application like that from there, perhaps. That's another step I would consider trying. So just want to put it out there. That's a different tutorial that I've made, different day. So. Um, more than welcome to follow along with that. I've made it on my channel. Go ahead and search for it. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.